as we welcome on the stage Sassy Finley Christie! Oh man, I love you guys. You are the most London crowd ever. Give us a cheer, Londoners in the audience. Yes. We love it. We're very proud Londoners. Like, we're, you know, we're hard. We're from London. Like, I'm hard. I'm a London. Like, being from London, you know, makes me hard in a way. Like, not that way, but fuck it, that way. We're proud. We're very proud people, you know. Like, we never get scared abroad, I feel like. I feel like Londoners could be in Yemen. We'd still be like, oh, civil war. Yeah, yeah, that's cute. I live in Greenwich. Uh, I live in a Victorian terrace right next to an estate. I live civil war, actually. I, I'd lived in London my whole life um, until last year. I lived in France for a year, right? And, and I, like, I feel like it's hard to feel unsafe in France as a Londoner. You know, like, it's on the mean streets of France. Like, whatever happens in my life, like, I'm not getting mugged by a guy called Guillaume. That's just not... That's not happening. Like, what, what's Guillaume going to do? Like, come up to me with a rapier and say, like, on garde! And then, like, <laughs> perfectly conjugate all of his complicated verb endings. Like, like Guillaume has no idea what I was doing on the streets when I, was, when I was 14, you know, like I was the king of like muggings when I was 14. I was getting mugged like every day when I was 14. You know, I, I, I got mugged so much in this one park, all the muggers chipped in and got a bench dedicated to me. That's all there is to do when you're 14 in London, just like get mugged and play Sunday League. You know, get together with your boys, see how close you can get to the vibrators and Ann Summers. I'm, uh, I'm doing online uni at the moment, right, guys? Do you understand how shit that is? Online uni. Like, uni's about, like, having fun, you know? Getting laid. Do you know how hard it is to get laid at online uni? <laughs> I feel like the gay best friend. Like, I'm not getting laid, but I've seen all the girls' bedrooms. <laughs> it's tough. And, like, I feel like in lockdown, you know, you've got to do messaging. You've got to be good at messaging because of the nature of things. You've got to be, you know, DMs, Tinder, whatever. So, like, I feel like, um, like I, my, I myself, it makes me nervous. Like, it stresses me out. Like, I don't even have the confidence to reply, like, directly into the messaging software. Like, what I do, right, is, is I, like, draft up potential replies in the notes app. Do you, do you yeah, right? You, you do this as well? I don't know what it is. Ever since I've had my first iPhone, right, I do this. I have, and I don't delete them. I have thousands of carefully like premeditated replies that I have designed to seem like spontaneous. It's an archive. It's the come across as natural history museum. It's ridiculous. And like, I, I had to buy like extra iCloud space because of it. And like the other day, like I'm reading through all my, my notes, you know, my archives, you know, I'm looking through my previous masterpieces. I'm like, oh, 2016, you know, my blue period. And I get a message from this girl. And she's like, uh, you know, what have you been up to today? And I'm thinking, all right, straight to the new note. You know, I get started, like I get to work. I'm thinking, how do I make this sound good? What have I been up to today? Uh, so I write, had a chill one today, X, you know. Because I didn't exactly like car pay the DM that day, you know. I was just like zoning out and eating toast, right? And then I think, can't just send that, because I haven't really said anything that sexy yet. So I add, uh, I can't lie and say I went to the gym. But I did think about going to the gym. So I put, had a chill one today. Bit upset I didn't go to the gym. <laughs> and then I'm thinking, hang on, I'm overanalyzing. I'm thinking, wait, bit upset that I didn't go to the... Why am I getting so emotional in this message? Am I opening up to this girl, right? A bit upset. I didn't go to the gym, so I change it. I'm like, I'm like, had a chill one today. Bit pissed off I didn't go to the gym. <laughs> Because in my head, like, the, the manliest emotion is rage for some reason. Like, I wish I could get angry the way I've seen real men get angry. You know, real men are like, were you looking at my girl, you fucking prick? Let's go outside. I feel like I'd be like, were you looking at my girl? She's banging, in it? She's banging. Yeah. Should we go outside? You got a cigarette? Come on, let's go. So now I'm looking at the message. Had a chill one today. Bit pissed off I didn't go to the gym. I'm thinking, that's going to kill the conversation stone dead. So I add... How about you? Now, guys, how about you is kind of my special move, right? Because when I bust out the how about you, you know, we're not talking about me anymore. We're talking about you, baby girl. That's all I want to hear about. So I'm looking at the message. Had a chill one today. Bit pissed off I didn't go to the gym. 
how about you? And, uh, and I don't have an ending for that bit because she hasn't replied yet. <laughs> how are we doing for time? How are we doing for time? <laughs>